Today I'm going to show you guys how to make a ton of transfer profit in Ultimate Team. I've been doing this method myself for all day today and it's very useful, very, very profitable indeed. It's so easy to do, you just got to be a bit patient, but to be honest, you don't even need patience. It's happening very quickly. So for me, whenever a play of the month comes out, guys, that's when I make the most transfer profit. You've got to be decent sniping as well to do it. And just be smart with it. So we do know that the player of the month, Hazard, is the current Premier League player of the month. And with that being said, for me, the first few players that I was instantly targeting and have made 50k in the past half hour alone just by doing this is... The two players I'm going to say now will be Alonso from Chelsea and Kovacic from Chelsea as well. Kovacic is a brilliant one to use. I've been buying him for 11k, selling him for 14k, and I've bought like 30 of them. It's been very, very useful in the past half hour, and he's been great. So in terms of the SPC itself, I have taken ages to do this. I'm glad that I didn't actually make like a... I guess like a proper normal SBC video on this. I wanted to show you guys how it's so profitable as well as doing the SBC. I'm going to move the uh, face cam box. No, you know what? I'll leave it there. I don't need that today. It's fine. So anyway, I've got this one to submit right now. And a player that I'm going to show you who is great to trade with. And if you guys can be good at sniping, you could buy this guy for like 1,000 coins or even 2K. If I could get this player for 4K, this guy right, this guy right here then I would be in dreamland. If you buy 10 of this card for 4K, you're looking at 40K profit right there, as an example. Like, he's selling for 8,000 coins. He's a non-rare from Cardiff. He's going to be in a lot of packs as well. 5K packs, for example, 7.5K packs. You can sell them on for double than 4K, is what I'm trying to say. So I actually was lazy with this, with this card in particular as I wanted to get this card really fast. So I just bought him off the SBC itself. But um, yeah, I'm going to submit the, this one right now. We have got a few big packs to open today. I'm doing all these SBC packs right now. Then I'm going to show you some players that I think you guys should look to buy as they are genuinely very good. So I'm actually going to get, I think right now, I've already got Iniesta in the club somewhere. Where is he? Have I not got Iniesta? Yeah, I have. Ah, I know he is. He is back here. So, Iniesta is a weird one. I was actually trading with him before. I did buy a few for like 15k, sold him for 19k, made 4k. Well, probably about 3.5k uh, profit off each one. And Iniesta, man, like, he's pretty much extinct. It'll take you about maybe, well, like, watch, watch this, guys. It's going to take you about, I'd say, 10 times, 10 attempts to snipe Iniesta. You're going to probably get him for 19k, as I got that in yesterday, therefore. But I got three earlier before this video for about 15k each. And they were difficult to get, as he's so rare. But if you can get him for that, guys, you'd be very, very happy with that. Also, it could be an idea to buy players like Iniesta, PK, um, players like that who are extinct right now. Because when that happens, usually EA do release a new price range for them. Not sure if that'll happen, but you never really know with EA. I'm going to add in Iniesta right now for the squad, and he'll be good to go there. And that one's done. So we do, yeah, we get a 100k pack from that. So I want to see what we get from these. Hopefully there's something amazing. And we do have some very big packs here, guys. I'm just saying. So the final one I've got here is this one. And again, even players like this guy, like I'll show you. I bought I, I bought another version of this guy's card. Well, another another of his cards for five hundred coins. He's selling for like two to well two to three k. So again, go for players who are non rare. And a big tip for you as well: definitely use Footbin.com as that website, guys. I mean, we all probably use it now. It tells you all the player prices. So many people use Footbin more probably so than Fred right now for SPCs. So whenever this guy, whenever there's like a non-rare and foot bin, their price on FIFA goes up. So this is exactly what's happened with this guy called uh, Prince Desir Guanu from um, MENs in Ligue 1. He should normally go for 500 coins, which I sniped him before with a different card. Got this one for 2k. He can go for like 3k. So again, if you get him for like 500 coins, guys, you're looking at 3k maybe profit, 2k maybe profit. And if you add, if you add everything up, if you do this for so many different cards, you can make 50 to 100k an hour, if not more. I'm not joking, you can. 
It's insane. So this one I'm going to submit. And we do get another EPL kit, which I think is the second time I've got that. And just like that, guys, we do have the player of the month, Hazard. Not even really the main focus of this video, but there you go. Hazard is now in my club, going to go right into my sub bench. There is Eden Hazard, guys. I like this animation a lot. It's very exciting. Belgian left wing Hazard, and he is in my club. Let's go. 93 pace, 86 shot. Fantastic card there for Mr. Hazard. What are his like um, in-game stats? Yeah, their quality. He's going to be amazing. Brilliant. Already got that kit. That can go. Okay. Before we get into more trading methods, guys, I'm going to um, quickly open the packs. So I think I've got seven packs to open. I'm going to confirm right now in Footbin which packs they are, though, as I have opened like quite a few packs today. So I could get confused. So we've got a mega pack, rare mega pack. Okay. Mega pack. What's the smallest pack I've got here? Rare play. Jumbo Premium Gold Players pack. Jumbo Premium Gold Players. There we go. Opening it right now, guys. This is from, I believe, which one is this one from? This, I think, is from... Which one? I'm not sure. Boards, anyway. We just got my man Kaita. He's selling for like 7k. I'll take it. Which SPC was that from in the Hazard SPC? Oh, there you go. From the uh, one-man show. SPC for Hazard. So... I actually like these SBCs, man. I really do. These rewards hopefully are going to be good. Going to sell them for like that. We'll see if it goes. Brilliant. Okay. So the next one I'm going to do, guys, is going to be the Belgium reward. So that's going to be a mega pack. At the same time, I'm opening these. I'm looking at Footbin to get the right ones. There you go. Mega pack. Right now, one walkout is all I'm asking for, guys, and I'm happy. Maybe there's a surprise here. Being in form. Boards. That's surprising. Spanish. Striker. Adaris can skip that. We know that's going to be him. I think he's like 4k right now. Let's have a look. 1.3k for him. What is this? My mindset is still in, still in the uh, FIFA 18 kind of mindset where he was way more. You know what? I'll keep, the, I'll keep them. 1,000 coins. Damn. Before I did sell Adaris, I just put him on the market for like no by now, really, like 10k by now. And he went for 800 coins. I was like, what the hell? That's stupid, but he is going for that. So, next one, rare mega pack. This is from the Premier League SBC. Rare mega pack? Is that like a 45k pack? I think it could be. Anyway, here we go. Will there be someone special? No 86 or above, but maybe there's an inform. It's boards, Italian. Uh, Viviano, not exactly exciting, to say the least. Just saying. Anyway, we get Viviano. Well, Jamie Vardy could go for a bit. In fact, he does go for 18k. Brilliant. Did not know that. Wow. Cool. I'll sell him for like that. He will go. Done. Vardy's on the market. I'll keep the rest. Anyone else there? We get a contract pack, which I'm not going to lie. I really want to get the player picks more often in packs. If there's like an 80 to 85 player pick pack, guys, and it's been done, let me know on Twitter or in the comments. Um, what's next? So I think we have... Yeah, the next one is going to be Chelsea SBC reward. So bear that in mind, guys. This is the Chelsea SBC. Oh, my. Oh, is that the big logo? I didn't see if that was a logo. I thought it wasn't. French. Tolisso. 83 overall Tolisso. I thought for a second it could have been the walkout. One walkout, guys, from this Hazard SBC is all, is all I really want, to be honest. Um, let's see. 6K, 2K for him? Guys, I'm telling you, with the Bundesliga Player of the Month which come into FIFA, go and get players like Tolisso. He will not be 2.3k. That is crazy price for him. Okay. Next one we're going to do is seven goals reward. So let's go for it. Go. <laughs> Clapping did not help. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. That did not help at all. Right mid. Spanish. I have no idea who that is. That is terrible. I had to shock him back right there. Yeah, that's awful. 2.5k though, I can quick sell that. Next one, let's go. I think I've already opened a mega pack and I've got another one somewhere, I can't find it. So you know what? I'm gonna open a rare gold pack to kind of compensate for the lack of a mega pack. Maybe there's a good one in here. 
Damn. Damn, I really want to get one walkout. If I don't get a walkout, guys, from these SPCs, that is a shock. That is a big shock right there. So we get no one really in that one. Sirigu. Okay. Final reward pack from the SPC, and then we're gonna get it gonna get into trading. Okay, here we go. 100 k pack. I'm predicting this is gonna be a walkout. Wow, it's not! What EA? Come on, that is tragic. Italian. Oh, that is awful. That is so bad. Perrin. From all of those Hazard SPCs, guys, I cannot believe we didn't get anything above 86. That's my worst pack opening of the year. Jesus Christ. Let's on the market. 3.7k. Jesus. Is there any, like, other good packs here? Because I'm tempted to do one more. You know what? I'll do this one. Premium Gold Players pack. This hopefully could be good. Or not. <laughs> be a board, at least. Oh, God. I'm going to stop opening packs, guys, because I've, I've actually saved a lot of these, so I need to save them for, like, a, maybe when the Ultimate Screen cards come out. Okay, I'll quick sell them. So, back on to the trading methods, guys, and for me, what's working right now is, for example, like I said before, players like Sewell is a very good example. When there's a Royce SBC, because it's most likely going to be Royce who gets the new SBC card, that's going to be a rating of probably, like, there's going to be a few different SPCs for Royce, like Hazard. They're going to need some good ratings, right? There's no way that Sewell is going to be 3.4k. I would predict he'd be probably, like, 5 to 6k. So if you are to buy, like, 10 of these right now, or even, like, 5, and then you sell them on for double profit, it's more coins for you. It's more like, how much is that? More like another 10k at least. It's profit for you, right? Look out for players like Javi Martinez. Sula is a great option to go for. Martinez is a very good option. Even Ribery right now, for example. Let's have a look. Ribery's price isn't that bad, I don't think. Let's have a look. Ribery on the market. I would assume he's like 10k. He's actually not too bad. What's his price? He's actually cheaper than thought. Okay. I think he's going to be 10-ish. 10.5. 10.5 for Ribery. And imagine when Royce's SBC comes out, guys. He's probably going to be like 14, maybe 15k, maybe more. He could even be extinct at some point. You never know. 11k on average there for Ubery. Another good one right there. In terms of players, though, I would advise going for right now. Like, I've got the likes of... So who sold? I bought Kovacic before for 11.5 there. Sold him for 2k profit. Um, Savic was not even an example to give there. But Kovacic is definitely one... A lot like Alonso would be a good one to go for. Any high-rated Chelsea player, Fabregas as well, could be very profitable to you as well. Higuain, the pack, Edison. Kaita, I got before. Who did I buy before? I bought someone decent. Ah, Kovacic again. How much are you getting for? I think I got him for, was it 12k? 12.5 maybe? 13k. I think I'll probably sell 14.5. Not the best profit there, but still, it's profit. I'm going to actually try and sell him for like 15k. Sometimes as well, people do forget a lot of players, guys, on FIFA do genuinely get impatient with SPCs. I know I do. So if you sell them for that, then you've got like at least 1.5k profit with EA tax, I do believe. Um, so yeah, that's a good one to go for. For example, I'll show you. Like Kovacic right now is very, very popular in terms of appearing on the market. The likes of Aspas are extinct, Iniesta is extinct, but they're, they're appearing like briefly. Kovacic, though is appearing more often see like that right there i just oh my god i thought i bought him that one right there would make you at least 3k profit guys in like four seconds work i mean it's absolutely ridiculous there you go again 12.2k guys just sniped probably sell for 14 15k i'm gonna try and sell them for four, for like 15k though i do think someone's gonna go for this in an impatient way genuinely people do i'm gonna try and do it 15k there you go Again, profit. This is how you make profit, guys. Such an easy method. There you go. No, oh, and they got him 10.5. Look at that. Again, this guy is great to snipe with, man. There you go again. 11.2k. Guys, I'm telling you. Go for players like Fabregas. Go for players who are needed. Kite is a good one. You can probably snipe Kite of like 3 to 4k if you really try hard. Like, it's ridiculous. I'm going to sell these for profit as well very easily. I'll go for that for him. Um, no matter what, I've made profit on that one. Any more? Again, 12.5. Another few K profit. I'm telling you guys, it's ridiculous how much profit you can make from doing this on SBCs. It's so, so useful. I'm actually going to go for that. I think he may go for that. 
Again, profit. Again, profit. <laughs> oh my god. This is amazing. I really want to get doing more like sniping videos, guys. It really is so exciting. Um, I'll go for that. Again, I'm going for that impatient SBC player. It's going to be the one that... Oh, no, damn. I reckon we can get one for like 10k. Maybe I'm pushing it, but let's have a look. Let's have a go. There you go. 10.5k. Nearly got him. Right there again, if you get him, you're gonna make some great profit. Another great way of seeing which players could be good profit for you is looking at cheap 84 rated in forms. Sabitza, otherwise known as Michael Bell, could be a decent one to go for. I think he's like 28K, maybe around that price. Yeah, 30-ish K, he could be a good one if he had a few more coins. The likes of, who else is here could be good? King could be a good one as he's Premier League, that could be a very good one. How would Esto's going to be one I'm going to focus on right now is I got him before for 11k, sold 15k, so he could be good to go for as well. 14k right there, probably shouldn't go with that one, but like, again, it shows that these cards are popping up. I'll probably make like a thousand coins of him there, but you can probably get him for like, I reckon 11 to 12k, which would be 3 k ish profit. See, there you go, look at that, 11.5k, brilliant side there, I'm proud of myself for that one. That was awesome. 11.5k. And just like that, guys, you can make yourself probably four to 5,000 coins in a few seconds. You've got to get quick at sniping, yes. But, like, he's going to sell instantly right now. 11.5k. And so many of these cards are 19k. Is he just going up in price? Has he actually just going up in price? 18k. Guys, I think I may have made more profit than I thought. Probably would sell. You know what? I'm going to put him up on the market for 17k. But, like, look at that. Again, I'm showing you how to make profit, guys. It's such a useful tip. Going to go for, like, that. And that would probably sell for 17k. Brilliant. I'm happy with that one. How this is one to go for as well. Cool. Awesome. Well, there you go. That is how you can make a lot of coins, guys, in a very quick period. Also, I think I've just sold some more players. Players keep selling. And they're not, like, showing up there. Anyway. Um, they should all sell for around about 15.5k, 15k-ish, which again is cool profit. Howardess, I think, has just sold. Howardess has just sold 16k. Well, there you go. There's some more profit right there, guys. We made about uh, 1,500 coins maybe off of Howardess there. However, that was the best one. That's probably about 5k to 6k profit. And that all adds up. So if you, if you guys want to use these tips, you're welcome to. Hopefully, this helps you as well. Do leave a like for more trading videos like this. I want to get doing more. They're very good fun. Have a great day, and I'll see you guys later.